Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm from letsbuildwebsites.com and I actually build websites for myself and make money online. So um, it's not easy because you have to build up a website and monetize it and actually make money. So I try out a lot of WordPress themes and um, I have stuck with a few after all these years and I'm going to go through and show you some. So the first one I'm going to show you is Thesis and this is a framework um, theme and it's very very basic. This is the standard Thesis theme without any goodies added to it. Now um, I have this on other websites so I'm just going to show you. Now this one here is thesis as well but I've tweaked it a little bit and just customized it to what I like. Now it's very simple still and there's nothing fancy about it but um, I'm trying to go for the minimalistic you know theme and um, I've just got the normal things that every website's got. I've got um, a search just up the top here I've got the menu up the top. Uh, I've got some advertising. I've got my logo and directly here is a sign up um, to sign up for my list. Okay then I've got some other things there as usual. So if you go into the posts you will see that I have a sharing bar on the side, um, some advertising in the posts and down the bottom as well and I allow comments on the website. Now everything is very very simple but you could take a good look at this website because it makes a lot of money. Um, not just because of the way it looks. I have um, this website's been around for I don't know since 2006 I think and um, but let me tell you that the website design does make a difference because I actually changed it probably about 10 times over the years and um, it's very dangerous for me to change it because your income could just turn into absolutely nothing. So as it is, uh, this is going along nicely and um, I'm happy with the plain thesis theme just with a little bit of um, a few added plugins and a little bit of customization. Um, I think this one here, this is the real uh, bare bones thesis. That's definitely too bare for what I need. All right, now this is thesis again, but this time I've um, added a skin to it to make it more interesting. And this actual skin is a sales page skin. So I'm actually selling a book. So um, this is part of the skin, this nice headline and everything. And all of these columns and stuff like that. Uh, there's me, Mitz. My name's Mitz. There we go. And it has add to cart buttons, this theme. Oh, not this theme, but this skin. Anyway, down the bottom, um, it even has a money-back guarantee and I just filled in this part here, okay? Now, it's very simple, these kind of things, and it's very, very effective. Now, this, like I said, this is Thesis and the skin is by Thesis Awesome. Okay, so if you want to check out any of these um, themes that I'm talking about, I'm just going to leave the links to the websites so you can check out what I'm talking about. It'll be in the description underneath the video. Alright, so I hope you get the picture about Thesis. It is very plain until you either customise it or add a skin to it. Okay, so I'll go on to something else. This is actually another Thesis blog again and um, this is a skin added to it. So you can see it's a little bit different. Okay. Comes up with a little bit different stuff again. Again, it's Thesis Awesome skin. 
I'll go up the top and I'll show you. Uh, it has a nice menu up there and it also has these other menu parts and stuff like that. Now it's very easy to customise and put your things in there or advertising or whatever. So yeah, that's Thesis again. Alright, now this time this one is a theme from Theme Forests and um, it's called Max Mag Responsive Theme and um, I like this one so much that I've actually put it on two websites so far um, all I did was add a menu which I already had obviously because I moved this onto an existing website um, the thumbnails were just automatic everything was automatic um, all I did is fill in my Twitter and Facebook and all that in the background and then these came to life. Now here's a search bar. Um, I added that there that's uh, Aweber form and um, yeah and it's just so easy and it it is making money and is doing very very well this theme and like I said I liked it so much that I put it on another website okay because it's got these fantastic features um, this is the home page and you can just really customize it and put in any um, categories with thumbnail pictures uh, you can have your latest post showing here you can have your latest post showing here or you can have all these other things here okay now um, that's one of my favorite ones at the moment pretty good okay now what I want to do is show you a different one again I'm just going to go inside one of my websites and go to the theme section because I have a elegant theme ready to go okay so all I have to do is press on this this um, elegant theme come up the top and say save and activate okay right so remember when I showed you this plain thesis website I'm just going to refresh it now and in a matter of seconds like you just saw I changed it to an elegant theme which I have already customized and ready to go and um, it's a hosting website now as you can see it's a little bit different to what I just had which was a plain thesis website okay now elegant themes is absolutely awesome and um, you can probably see why now all the customization is pretty much done for me um, and it is very good for beginners whereas the thesis WordPress theme uh, you need a little bit of skill to customize it or you need to add a skin on all right um, now all of these websites make money and I have chosen them because they are making conversions okay so and I have done a lot of testing um, at one stage I changed the theme on this website this tips for PC website and my income just absolutely went in the drain and I just could not believe the difference it, it was um, with just changing a simple theme all right um, thanks for watching and I hope that helps you make a decision on what theme you need for your website